What's up? My name is Jason Flood and I'm very happy to be bringing you an interview with an up-and-coming musical act. Now, when I heard about this segment, I knew I wanted to get involved. I love music. I always have and I always will. But I like music that's different. I like music that's edgy. And there is no up-and-coming artist right now in Dublin that is different and edgy like my guest. Ladies and gentlemen, George. What's up, George? How are you? But since then, you have released your first single, titled Stonewall. So tell me a bit about the creative steps you as the artist take when releasing a video like this. Well, I mean, in regards to writing the song, it was it, it was right, it was written in the concept in the sense that like you're numb and you don't really care about anybody else or anybody else's views. Basically, um, in regards to that, though, I, I hope it, I, I wanted to make it as a like this. How should I say this? I wanted to go, I wanted to come out with like I wanted to come out running, if you know what I mean. I didn't want to I didn't want to release like a fun like a fun little I wanted to come, come out hard and continue that with the next few releases, you know what I'm saying? And you've come through a lot of momentum. Like I remember when we worked together, I could see you were very talented. You know, I see you put a lot of work in what you do. But just because I know it doesn't mean other people know it. True, true. But now with this release, you're starting to get some recognition. So oh, tell me what the reaction's been like. The reaction's been really good. I, I genuinely didn't think it would be as big as well as good as you know it, it, um, it was. Because basically, like, anybody when you put music out there, you're always like, oh shit, people gonna judge me now. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Because it's the internet. Everybody's gonna have an opinion. Do you know what I mean? But like literally, the, I'm, I have not heard a single bad thing about this. I've had people, I've had people send me Insta screenshots from Twitter saying like, I'll check the song out. Like, Who the fuck is that? Who's sharing my shit? Like, do you know what I mean? I'm not paying anybody for promotions. So people are just sharing it because they like it. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> The plan was I put up on I put it up on SoundCloud, uh, Spotify, also Apple Music. It's uh, Stonewall. Stop it, Stonewall. George the Second George with a J. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what's the misconception you people do with a G? I bet you. Everybody does it with a fucking G, man. But I don't blame them. It's probably J E O R G E I I Stonewall, right? Basically, the plan was um, on SoundCloud. The plan was like, see if, if I can get like I don't know, 500 views in a month, right? And I'll be like, sweet. Now uh, it's been two weeks and I'm over a K, which is oh my god, pretty sweet, if you ask me. That's pretty serious coverage to get. Ah man, it's like like I said, small steps, small steps. A few shows coming up, so like, hopefully after that, hopefully after that, we'll have them. I'll, I'll get that shit and then we can push on. And speaking of shows, on November 10th, you are performing for the Fried Plantains Collective I event, indeed. Black Jam. So tell me a bit about that. Well, basically, that actually all started off like a month ago because I was doing an open mic night, my first open mic night. How was that? It was pretty fucking fun. We did it with the Archie Collective, shout out to them, there's some good MCs. Um, but basically, what happened was I was doing my set and this lady in the crowd afterwards came up to me and she was like, what she gave out like? No, no, she. <laughs> <laughs> I thought she was. Just, she's she's like, like, oh, you're really good. <laughs> that is the worst impression. I know. It's so much really good. I know, out. but like she, okay, she was like, oh no, you're really good. And do I come up to do my show? A bit more for us uh, on the not on the tenth of November, um, in February's five year old. Um, but um, I thought it was five. George's manager is no gesture. I thought the I conversation. thought it was five. It's, it's five online. At the door. It's ten at the door. It's ten at the door. But it's five online. Five online though. I was gonna say though. Um, but yeah, so she she, she, text, she hit me up after that show. She's like, yeah, but we love we, we love this set, so we love to do for you doing the show. Me, I was happy because someone came up to me like, oh shit, that was really good. Yeah, you know like it, obviously. Yeah. Exactly. Um, and that's so uh, that's coming up on November tenth. Yeah. So tell us, you know, you released the one while you've gone great reaction. You're doing live shows. What I want to know is that what's coming up in the next few weeks in terms of releases. Are we going to see more tracks coming out, or are we going to see an EP? That's what I really want. To know. Well, basically, what's happening within the next couple, the next couple, uh, next couple months. My plan is before before Christmas, before New Year's, I want to have three songs out. Right. So hopefully, span those across. We we'll say no, no certain dates, but we we'll say November, December, some of those. But also in interluding those two, I want it because I mean, it's not just you can't pop a song out and then have people listen to that. Then I want to keep people going. Do you know what I mean? Because yeah, yeah. every, every get you see an artist, it's like that is a sick song. Yeah. We wait for another like. You want to write the wave like exactly, yeah, exactly. Yeah. exactly. So. Continue with that, we're going to do some freestyles, we're going to get some stuff put out. So, look, like I said, Instagram, George, uh, George underscore underscore I, I, George for second. George would just have been George with a J, J E O R G E. <laughs> so, there you have it, guys. So, that was my interview with George. Now, don't forget to follow George on his social media accounts. George with a J, not a G, George with a J. And keep up with what this talented artist is going to release next. Well, George, thanks for joining us. Thank you, man. I'm you. sorry for shit, I am casual. Thank you for having me. Beautiful, thanks. No problem, it's cool. And I am Jason Flood with Limelight. See you next time. Okay, one last time. Yeah.
J E O R G E underscore underscore I I. Set it as your lamb. Name your daughter. I don't care. Get a tattoo. Just remember the name. Who won?